Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So as promised, I'm gonna be doing a makeup review on Tada! Karya Cosmetic. So uh, enough wasting our time. Let's just dive into the box. This this one is actually a uh, promotion punya box. Right, promotion punya box. Uh, let's talk about the box first. The box, the design, the color, simple, cantik. I suka sangat. Okay. Inside, inside here we have. These are the things that I bought from Karya and also I did free gifts kali which uh, comes with the set. Ah, uh, sampo duit raya from Karya. And also, <coughs> where's my voice? Okay, and also, the other bagi card. And it says here, May you have a blessed Eid Mubarak with your loved ones. And let's take your hashtag Raya Selfie to the next level with Karya Cosmetic. Because being gorgeous and dazzling during the joyous celebration is not a problem anymore. P.S. Don't forget to share your hashtag MOTD Karya Cosmetic. Karya. Ta-da! Thank you. So kita tengok apa yang set apa yang I beli dekat dalam ni. I'm sorry about the mature and everything. I think everyone is excited for Raya. I know. Walaupun kita PKP, tapi um, Raya tetap Raya. Okay. This is this the first set I bought from Karya. This one is the foundation. Uh, in code fair and also medium. This, I think this is set anting and it comes with these two free gifts. Got beauty blender So that nanti kita akan Use this beauty blender Selepas tu I beli um, Dia punya makeup kit This is uh, One is makeup kit In coat uh, Travel daring This one ada Bronzer Highlighter Blusher Eyeshadow And then this one Is a Brow make kit Untuk your brows lah Dia ada Eyebrow powder Concealer And also uh, Dia comes with brush So the free gift For Um Brow me kit is the Dia bagi Bag makeup sekali yang kecil Okay dia bagi kita okay, I think this is eye, Eyebrow punya pencil With A sharpener Oh my god sharpener dia so cute Because I dengar banyak review pasal dia punya eyeliner tau So um, I kena beli loose uh, I I had to buy juga Sebab this set tak ada Tak comes with eyeliner So I beli loose So this is dramatic proof liner From Kara Cosmetic Okay, I tak nak bebel banyak-banyak I'm going straight to the thing And I'm gonna give you my thoughts On Kara Cosmetic Okay, I dah prep my skin. Sebenarnya Karya Cosmetic ni dah sampai lama dah. Uh, hari, I tak ingat hari apa. Uh, tapi, I tak buka lagi sebab I nak bagi korang honest review. So, this one is the foundation. Dia ada SPF 50 sunscreen. This lightweight tinted sunscreen helps provide natural coverage and protect your skin from sun damage. The ingredients are vitamin C, vitamin E, argan oil and hyaluronic acid. So I nak tengok dulu the the foundation everything lah. Is the foundation so pretty. I bottle dia simple je. Yeah, very simple and very nice. Okay, it's in code fair here. It's a pump. Okay, it's a pump here. I'm going to use my P ring untuk put the foundation inside. This one is medium. Gotta shake the bottle first. I can pump this one dekat sini. This is medium. Maybe it's a new one. So okay, this one is fair and this one is medium. The medium one is a little bit tan. I'm not sure if it suits my skin. This medium. Does it my skin too? Oh. Oh. It has this familiar smell. What is it? Okay, dia bau lime. Oh, so nice. I memang suka, I suka gila bau lime. Sedap selimi bau. <laughs> Rasa nak makan. Okay, so I'm gonna take the fair one. Okay, it's a little bit lighter for my skin. So, kalau I nak mix together pun, boleh untuk dapatkan my skin tone. It's fair, uh, medium. So, I got this. This is the... Combination 
okay like it looks good so far it's very very dia texture dia sangat watery and in the same time it has this light um it's very light lah i'm just gonna mix this together i rasa i i akan share juga dengan korang uh, the difference between using diorang punya beauty blender i suka beauty blender yang yang lembut okay it's not that lembut dia keras so i'm gonna um basahkan dia dulu before using it i think i'm going to dip it dalam water dulu okay i'm back so i dah dip dalam water but still a bit keras i'm going to mix this two dulu just going to grab this gives me this color. Okay, at this side, I akan pakai uh, dia punya uh, sponge dulu. And this side, I akan pakai di, I akan pakai my brush. I'm going to see the coverage juga. The sponge. It's not full coverage. Maybe because Terlalu sikit. I'm gonna add some more. Mixing it. Okay lah. The, the sponge is not as bad as I thought. The foundation is... I do is looking sangat sangat great. I love the smell, the lime smell actually. Oh my god. I suka gila. So now we're going to use a brush. I'm going to blend it using my brush. Okay. As for me, I like this side better than this one because I actually like the sponge punya effect tau. It looks macam very very moist but this side looks a bit dry so I prefer using the sponge. So let's just finish all this thing pakai sponge. I think sangat pretty. I think this one looking very very great and the, the coverage is like I don't know. I as for me, I like it sangat sangat. Though the coverage is not that good, but uh, maybe the technique that I'm using tak berapa proper, so that's why I cannot cover some of my scars. Memang obvious gila, so it's a little bit hard. But the foundation, like okay, moving on to the eyebrow. So I can pakai this uh, brown me kit dulu. This one pata. I memang tak buka lagi. I memang tak I memang purposely nak bagi korang honest review sebab tu I tak buka langsung tak tengok pun lagi. I tak tahu nak cakap sama ada the foundation is a bit to uh, walaupun I dah combine still a bit to uh, cerah ataupun sometimes when I go uh, like um, lagi dekat dengan camera it looks a bit a uh, tan like am i tan so this is the box at the back of the box there are the this this one the other guy the e1 e2 this this is the thing i assume this is the thing inside lah and then uh e1 e2 ni uh dia ada bagi tahu apa benda apa benda semua well packed sangat nice dia macam tart dia ada kotak ada kat dalam Wait, I suka gila dia punya dia punya bekas. Sebab nampak dia punya hitam tu shiny very exclusive. It comes with cermin. Oh, I'm so happy. Ada cermin. Okay, this is the uh, this ni lah. Dia ada plastik sekali. So, this is the brow me kit. Dia ada this shade. I think this one is a cream. I rasa this one is concealer. This one is concealer. Dia ada for dark skin and also light skin so i'm just going to go with the darker one because i'm not that not that 
uh, fair pun my, my skin color They give two brush Which is this brush So I think the edge brush ni untuk create maybe the eyebrow And then this one is to This one is for the concealer lah I tak pernah pakai Bukan I tak pernah, I jarang use a powder I usually pakai pencil So I takut I tak berapa reti dan tak berapa selesa with it So I'm gonna go with this uh, shade dulu Untuk create the Untuk create the tail of my eyebrow Oh my god It's Are you freaking kidding me? Okay, let me finish this first. Sumpah ni power gila babe. Oh my god, this is the... Korang tahu tak? I just macam... That macam tu je tau. Dekat the powder And then the effect macam Power gi I'm sorry about the noise The effect power cover Blah, blah, blah. Aku dah tak tahu dah apa aku cakap The effect power gila babe Okay korang tengok eh Korang nampak tak You freaking kidding me, Karya? Okay, okay. Can I just cry first? Amazing! I'm gonna use my spoolie to brush it up first. Weh, power gila, babe. Brow kit dia. My cunning is enough. Okay, sekarang ni I nak conceal yang tercacat kat situ. Using this brush So I akan ambil Yang gelap ni lah sikit Sebab ni memang colour I I'm just gonna conceal Oh my god Concealer dia power gila Okay bagi tahu I How do I moved on from this The brown kit overall I think I suka sangat it, it 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 looks very soft but it was there nampak Thank you Karya Moving on to the next item which is tada the openest makeup kit in code truffle daring So this one is truffle daring dia juga sama juga macam tadi Really, how can I am not in love with it? Kau tahu tak, benda ni boleh jadi cermin juga. Sekarang kita akan tengok kat dalam ada cermin ke tak. Okay, how's the everything inside lah. Okay, this is what it looks like inside. I tak berapa suka the, the, I mean the, apa nama, packaging. Bukanlah packaging. I, I tak berapa suka dia punya uh, bekas dia. I tak berapa, I tak berapa suka. Because dia macam Like that So macam bagi I, I takut Dia macam fragile But Ada cermin Hi <laughs> This one is the Blusher Oh This one is blusher Okay I think Maybe colour dia um, A bit orangey If you apply Sebab dia nampak uh, brown shade kat sini So I'm not sure if it's brown Or it will come up a bit orange Sikit I mean peachy sikit ke Ni daripada segi Dia punya texture It looks like this one is the lip cream And this one is the shimmer I yakin this is the shimmer This one is the eyeshadow Oh my god This colour we're, we're going to try this This one looks very nice This one is the bronzer And this one is the highlighter Tak cakap tadi, I nak try this one, right? So, kita... I takut! I'm using a blending brush. Ni. I'm going to take... Oh my god. I'm going to take this shade right here. 
Oh my god The pigmentation is real bitch Sorry <laughs> Sumpah lah I baru dip macam tu je kot Okay tak Okay sorry eh Okay I, I'm going to clean this first Kau nampak I dah clean kan So Dah tak ada extra excess lah Okay I akan dip je Like that And then I'm gonna apply Right here Kau nampak tak dia dah appear Kau Oh my god I'm gonna cry Sumpah sekejap gila sebab dia punya eyeshadow sangat power And now I'm using a different brush yang macam ni Yang macam ni And then I'm going to dip it into this shape Yang brown sikit ni And I akan buat smoky eyes Okay, I suka sangat dia punya eyeshadow sebenarnya Sangat suka, sangat sangat suka <laughs> Okay, so sekarang ni I nak try shimmer dia I I, I dah beritahu banyak kali I rasa I'm not a big fan of shimmer But I'm just gonna try the shimmer Oh okay, the shimmer dia punya Dia punya quality sama macam Zoe Wah, I suka So, I'm just gonna put it like Dekat bahagian dalam ni Oh oh Korang nampak tak tu Okay, I usually blend the shimmer on my eye Tapi this one, I rasa I tak perlu blend Sebab dia sangat cantik Dia sangat cantik weh <laughs> I tak boleh move on As you can see This is the eyeshadow Uh, the and the shimmer so i i was thinking about letak the highlighters but highlighter ni pun nampak macam shimmer sikit dekat dekat kok and dekat my inner corner no I'm just gonna share dengan korang uh, about the foundation so i rasa it's A bit uh, Tacky sikit At the beginning tadi Masa saya Lepas lepas saya apply And sekarang Dia Still tacky but That Dia tak tacky sangat So um, I don't really like The tacky punya feelings But I think uh, Lepas uh, Few minutes Dia akan okay Saya so, tak suggest you guys Pakai um, Powder Because Uh, dia akan Buat Nampak khaki sikit I rasa I rasa Moving on to the Okay moving on to the eyeliner uh, So I akan buka Dia punya Kita akan tengok Applicator dia macam mana semua Dramatic waterproof liner Okay Nampak <laughs> Cantik Okay so um, Kita akan tengok dia punya applicator So this is the applicator Tak tak kurang nampak tak This is the applicator It's not a brush I can say that it's not a brush It's uh, Dia macam sponge Oh But eyeliner dia sumpah hitam gila babe Okay I dah curl my lashes Now I'm going to apply The um, eyeliner Okay, it 
it splash sikit because I think the sponge ni terlalu banyak eyeliner I'm going to create a very thin line Maybe I can try It's a bit hard to I create this thin very thin line sebab the applicator applicator dia agak besar so we're just going to try this Okay. Korang boleh nak create those thin line Tapi korang kena guna betul-betul ujung dia I don't really like the applicator because it makes my eyeliner nampak very very thick because I memang prefer thin eyeliner but daripada segi the color of the eyeliner sangat sangat bagus sangat sangat black I suka sangat but it's just macam terlalu wet so macam comot sikit bawah mata I because it's too wet and lambat kering Okay, so this is how it looks like after putting those falsies. Now moving on to the contouring part. So this is the contour. I just made a bunny gila excess I ambi. Okay. Now we're just going to contour the face using the contour powder kat dalam ni. I think dia warm down sikit the foundation yang I rasa macam terang tu. So So I'm going to put a uh, highlighter sikit at my at the tip of my nose and also the bridge of my nose lah. Now I'm going to apply the uh, blusher. Okay. As for me, dia dah nampak a bit macam orangey sikit. So I think dia bukan brown shade. I'm going to use the brush they gave me going to try it. Oh my god, bulu dia lembut. I suka bulu dia. Bulu dia lembut gila. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna I'm gonna use my brush because I rasa memang I suka brush I lagi. So I think kalau you guys are going for macam a uh, very brown atau nude kind of look, korang boleh use this truffle daring punya palette. Off to the uh, lipstick, I'm gonna use this the lip cream right here. This shade, I think I'm just. I'm actually curious the about the color. I'm gonna use this brush. Wow, you nampak very natural. I suka gila sebab sebab the color dekat um dekat the palette. Macam dark tau But it turns out very nice I can uh, uh, apply Ta-da Disebabkan tadi I terlupa Nak apply a highlighter So sekarang kita akan tengok highlighter dia pula This is the highlighter Uh, takutnya air rasa banyak gila yang ambil Ah, so nice 
Oh my god The highlighter pun nice gila weh I'm just going to set my face with the setting spray Hi guys, I'm back and this is the final result and my final thoughts. So kau nampak kan? I suka sangat today's new makeup. Looks very uh, macam nampak macam my skin lah. I suka dia tak nampak terlalu thick. So I I rasa Karya Cosmetic have done a very very good job sebab anything anymore so let's just go straight to the item um for the foundation i gave them four out of five so but um i don't really like the tacky feeling on my face right now dia uh, tadi masa after i apply dia memang tacky gila but it slowly um hilang that tacky feeling but it still have those tacky feelings so kalau kau nak pakai macam setting powder tu boleh lah but i don't recommend using a loose powder yang loose powder tu kan i, I don't recommend that because it will be either um khaki ataupun dia akan jadi smooth either two so kalau kau orang jadi khaki it's very very not good lah so this i give a uh, four out of five uh, I must suka gila And this smells good You know It smells lime Next Next is the Brow me kit Okay This one I gave it 10 out of 5 Because I love it so much Just using the brow me kit My My eyebrow already looks alive I don't need mascara I don't need brow gel Or any brow Punya item untuk Nampakkan The Bulu kening tu nampak alive Because it already looks alive Just with this So this one Is my favourite This one is um, 10 out of 5 And the concealer is So nice Next Is the uh, Kara Cosmetic Oneness Makeup Kit In code Truffle Daring Okay So for Truffle Daring ni I give them 5 out of 5 Because Uh I think everything in in here sangat nice except for the um for the bekas like I kurang suka bekas dia bekas, because I rasa macam dia mengganggu kalau macam I tak bawa cermin dia dia, dia dah ada cermin it's a good thing but uh, dia punya apa namanya bekas itu kurang friendly as for me dia mengacau I punya hands to work at my face lah so I give them 5 out of uh, five. I love the lip cream. I love the bronzer, the shimmer, the eyeshadow. Everything is perfect on this oneness makeup kit. But sadly, for the dramatic waterproof eyeliner, I think Karya Cosmetic maybe boleh improvise lagi. Maksudnya, my Maybelline is still number one and this turns into number two because um, it's a li the applicator is a little bit bigger so it's a bit hard for me to create a very thin line. Memang dia akan jadi tebal but if you betul-betul determine nak buat those thin line, you can guna yang paling hujung sekali. Boleh jadi tapi you kena pakai yang paling hujung sekali barulah dia akan work. And then uh, dia punya tahap Kehitaman eyeliner tu adalah Pada tahap 10 Memang power gila So This one out of 5 I gave Them 3 and a half Because I don't like the applicator But I like the The blackened eyeliner I love almost everything Except for the eyeliner punya applicator je Applicator dia je That is all my final thoughts on Kara Cosmetic So I'm gonna list everything down In my description box And Inshallah in the future I will be doing more review on other makeup products, brands and more And if you have any suggestion on uh, other products that I should be doing a review on Please, please, please do leave a comment on the comment section down below Thank you very much for watching and see you guys next time Bye bye